So you want to understand demerit points in Ontario. No problem. I'm going to break it down for you. And if you're a new driver, you want to watch right till the end because that's when you're going to get information specific to you. And what you really want to do is hit that follow button so you make sure you stay up to date with news and information that applies to you as an Ontario driver. First off, you do not lose demerit points. You earn them, and it's not a good thing. It's just like golf. The lower your score, the better you are. Also, they stay on your record for two years from the date of the offense, not conviction. If you're a fully licensed driver, not a new driver, this is the breakdown. From 2 to 8 points, you get a warning letter. From 9 to 14 points, you get another warning letter, urging you to become a better driver and person. At 15 or more, you're going to get a 30-day license suspension. And if you don't surrender your license, you could receive a further suspension of up to 2 years. Now, when it comes to new drivers, it's a little bit different. So it's going to be 2 to 5 points for you for your first letter, 6 to 8 points for your second letter, urging you to be a better driver in person, and then 9 or more, you're going to get a 60-day license suspension. And of course, if you don't surrender it, you could get a suspension up to 2 years. Not good. And when are you considered a new driver? Well, it's if you have a G1, G2, M1, M2, M1L, or M2L license. It's a lot of different 1s and 2s and Ls. And did you know that they were escalating penalties for newer novice drivers? Yeah, that's a thing. Let me tell you about it. Escalating penalties apply to new and novice drivers, and I'll read straight from the website. Escalating penalties can apply if you are convicted of breaking graduated licensing rules, like driving on a company and stuff like that, convicted of a Highway Traffic Act offense that results in four or more demerit points, like street racing or careless driving, stunt. Uh, or if you are subject to a court-ordered suspension for a Highway Traffic Act offense that would have otherwise resulted in four or more demerit points. What does it mean? Well, on the first offense, your driver's license is suspended for 30 days. On your second offense, uh, you are suspended for 90 days. On your third offense, you'll lose your novice license. I just read it right there. You will need to reapply for your license and start all over, taking all tests and paying all fees. You will also lose any time discount you earned any time you were credited, and any fees you have paid. So that sucks. But then again, if you get there, it's because you did it, and then nobody else.